Kiss 95.1. Hey, it's Cameron. And gearing up for the Carolina Ascent FC's first match on August 17th, I have a special guest with me, Amanda Vandervoort, who is the president of the United Soccer League Super League. Amanda, welcome to the KISS studio. Oh my gosh, it's amazing <laughs> to be here. Thank you. Thank you. Um, do you want to pull your mic down just a little bit? I can do that. No yep. problem. Perfect. Is that better? It's perfect. Oh, beautiful. It's got the screen too. <laughs> yeah, so when right? I like get super excited and yeah. spit on the microphone, exactly. it's fine. It's covered. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> so talk to us a little bit. We have a lot of major league sport teams here in the Carolinas and Charlotte. Uh, this is a new one for us. So talk to us about the USL Super League and what it is. Yeah, uh, Division One women's professional soccer. Uh, like you said, yeah, we aug- we launched August 17th, which is, oh my gosh, time is ticking away. Uh, we have eight teams across the country, so um, from Brooklyn down to Fort Lauderdale, Florida, all the way across to Spokane, Washington, we're covering the map. And um, couldn't be more excited than to bring professional women's soccer to more cities, more communities than ever before. Yeah, and Carolina is the newest one. Mm-hmm. Uh, what made the Carolina such a good fit for this league? I mean, obviously, this is a sports town. People love soccer here. They love their sports, so... That, that makes all the sense in the world. The ownership group here has been incredibly dedicated and committed to bringing professional women's soccer to the Carolinas. Like it's been absolutely incredible. And then getting Philip Poole, your head coach, he has built a culture and a foundation and a club I think that any of us could be, are incredibly proud of. Yeah, it was really cool. I showed, I came to the uh, Jersey unveiling and oh, there yeah. were so many young girls and young kids and I played soccer growing up and it's been such a thing in the Carolinas for so long. And so now getting a women's professional team is so exciting here. Yeah, you can feel the energy, yeah. right? I was here for the brand reveal maybe back in April Um, maybe a little bit earlier than that, but yeah, the energy and the excitement and just like this kind of moment that we realize like, wow, we, we've been missing this and it's filling this void that so many people like yearn for. Yeah. And so, yeah, what a special moment in time. Definitely. What are your hopes for the future as far as, uh, you know, the league and the Carolina Ascent FC and women's soccer nationally? Yeah. I, well, I mix, I think the, the game of soccer, women's sports, I mean, let's start there, right? Women's sport. We've got the Olympics on in the yes, background. The rugby team too is like all over social media. I'm loving seeing it. <laughs> yeah. And so we're in this moment right now where women's sports and women's soccer is, is just exploding. And so in being in this moment in time and launching a women's soccer league, it's like it's like we've met the, met the moment. We are the moment, yeah. right? And yeah. and to be able to kind of lean into that and then drive the future of professional women's sports and being a leader in what that's going to look like through the lens of women themselves. I think is a really powerful opportunity. Yeah, and it gives young girls inspiration and another outlet to feel empowered, which is like one of my favorite things about getting involved in sports at a young age. Mm-hmm. Um, and little boys. Yes, little boys too. Can look Anybody, up to these yeah. women athletes and say, wow, like those women are, you know, they're they're amazing. They're incredible athletes. Mm-hmm. And it's it's equally as cool and accepted for women to be professional athletes as it is for men. So we have to create those spaces so that these amazing women can step into it. Definitely. What are what do you want fans to know about this team? Uh, gosh, I think fans will love watching this team play. First of all, the dynamic um, roster that Coach Poole has put together is unbelievable. They're also a great group who wants to be, do right by the community. So you've seen them out at soccer tournaments. You see them out at events at at, at um, I don't know, whatever, the bars and stuff that the club has put different events on. And they really believe in professional women's soccer in the Carolinas and, and what that means, not just to them as the highest level elite athletes or to their parents, who I know are all really excited <laughs> too. But um, to your point, to the community, the broader community, the girls and boys and, and the, the other women here who aspire to, you know, support professional soccer. Yeah, I love that. Okay, so first match is August 17th. Mm. What can we expect? Oh, it'll be packed. It'll be packed. <laughs> well, duh. Yeah, it's amazing. Get your tickets now. They're going fast. We're uh, we're expecting a, a, a packed house and the the game. So the team they're playing against is our DC Power FC. So they'll be down here, and it'll be a great game. Both teams, both rosters are really packed with high high-level players and talent. And so I think you're going to see a compelling game with – 
I don't know, exciting atmosphere. I yeah. Think. Yeah. You were talking about that energy and atmosphere yeah. just kind of matching up. And for an inaugural game yeah. and the first match, like, I can only imagine how loud that stadium is going to be. Yeah. You, do, you don't want to miss it, right? It's one of those moments you want to be part of because soccer is now. Yeah. And this moment is now. Like, being part of that moment is something that, um, you know, I, I said this to the players this morning. Like, you, you don't get to launch leagues and teams I mean, hardly ever. What what a unique experience, right? And for the fans to come and be part of that moment with us is a once in a lifetime. Yeah, it's sports history. And then it's also local history, which yeah. is super cool. Even if somebody maybe not or doesn't know a ton about soccer, or doesn't really know what they're getting into to be a part of something that's a first in Charlotte, I think is reason enough to check it out. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming in and hanging with us today. And we can't wait for the Carolina Ascent FC season to kick off. Cool, thanks. <laughs>